Welcome back. You're still watching the sports and we're talking lighter, brighter, better. Yes. Of course, talking about skin lightening and all of the things along those lines. And I think it's a very important point, as I actually mentioned in the beginning, which is the fact that people actually have a right to make choices on their own. Mm -hmm. And um, but let's look at that a little more in the, like, Michael Jackson, for example, mm. oh. has insisted Mm -hmm. or insisted till he passed away mm -hmm. that he didn't bleach because he was ashamed of his skin color. He yeah. said he had a skin condition called yeah. vitiligo, vitiligo, which yeah. is which when is you're... Real. Exactly, it's a real it's a thing. Real thing. Yeah. Yeah. Whether he had it or not, we don't it, know. Yeah. But if he had it and that was why he did it, it, I think it's a fair argument. So when those sort of things happen, for example, how do you engage do you that person? Do you know what I'm saying? Maybe we'll have medical reasons. Okay, yeah. then again, the weather, where you are, abroad, bleach, feel free. <laughs> Why? The weather would, you know, um, would support your skin. Mm -hmm. Lagos weather. It's a lot. Is he has Abuja yeah. weather. Yeah. The sun will kill you. Yeah. It has a point. Because you when you bleach, you're thinning, like you said, you're thinning the layer of your yeah. skin. And so in tropical areas. In tropical areas, it doesn't work. And especially when you ha want to have children. For women, once you, your skin starts to expand, it's not as strong as mm. it should be. So there are complications with you even being able to be a vessel to actually hold another person. Wow. Are you serious? Yes. Vessel. Because you've thinned your skin out so much that it's... it's you maybe can't stretch it. Maybe because you a lot more pain. the natural order of things. Wow. Yeah. But wow. Again, what I don't like about... I mean, if, you, if that's the path you want to go down, if that's the decision you want to make about your life, that's fine. Now, again, my issue is I've been in Lagos and I've seen huge billboards of a particular brand, a, a skin whitening brand, like everywhere. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, we don't need to start literally feeding the minds of the young people that right. this is what is right. right. I don't care what you do behind closed doors. Mm -hmm. That's you. But when you have skin lightning um, apps. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Even on your, yeah, that's true. Because that on the will phone. will teach you how to lighten yeah. your, your skin Where your pictures will lighten basis. your skin. Mm -hmm. What the heck is that? I know mm -hmm. this girl, of Vubada, it was last week or so. I think I saw it on a blog. Name withheld mm -hmm. that she said she would um, see one uh, media house for writing that her, 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 wedding, her product bleaches yeah you know and I, how long did it take her to come back and say yeah. it actually bleaches you know okay thanks you know and i'm like okay who what would you um sue them for mm -hmm. for saying that this thing is wrong yeah or you telling know? the truth yes yeah. you know so i think i think yeah, I'm, as, as Ibuka said, we all have a role to play. I do. I definitely have an issue with um, people and organizations and institutions that push the message and don't. I'm not saying government should say no. Don't sell your whitening cream or whatever. <laughs> let people understand be. the dangers. But yeah, let people also understand the dangers. It's and like also, how, it's like how cigarettes are, are sold. You sell it, but you, you let people know. Okay, mm -hmm. you're it's buying. Turning into, it's turning into a national issue. Yeah. You know, and I would um, talk to my friends, <laughs> you know, my fellow. Um, you know, um, uh, of the okay. yes, <laughs> you know, let's sit down, pass a law. We've all heard about the story of the particular yeah. brand store that closed in London because they had things that the authorities considered to be illegal yeah. in mm -hmm. their store mm -hmm. that that's used to whiten skin. Yeah, they shut down your entire business, your entire life because you. It you're, was selling. you're selling a harmful yeah. product. Now, let's talk about some of the celebrities that, because, I mean, there've, there's been a lot of controversy about people that bleach. But a lot of times, a lot of celebrities are accused of bleaching. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of celebrities have Should had... We really talk about them? Because yes, these we days can. now, they yeah. want each other. No. <laughs> <laughs> and they even No, beat. I mean, listen, no one's going to beat me. Well, maybe Gabore will. I mean, there's... <laughs> there's no, been, since there's you been want us to talk about... I'm no, not scared, about no, but since you're said, pushing, let's just... <laughs> Let's talk about it. Someone, I mean, I remember reading, they've said Iman, the model, the supermodel, they've mm -hmm. accused her of bleaching. They show pictures of her from years ago and say she was much dark, darker and now she's, mm -hmm. she's like a caramelly kind of color before where she was a bit more dark chocolate. Mm -hmm. You Nicki know, and, and then Nicki Minaj, they've accused Yvonne her of bleaching. Nelson. Have they accused her? Yeah, they accused, so I remember they, they did. I, I saw you know both what? pictures. You did? <laughs> yes, I did. And oh. it was, it was all just lighting. I saw okay, <laughs> let, let's talk about brother. this lightning Let's thing. talk about Which the lightning thing. Because a lot magazines. of people get it wrong yeah. with magazines and, um, you know, thinking that people have actually been bleached when they haven't. Yes. I've heard Lupita? Beyonce, Lupita, um, people. Gab lighting is very, very powerful. Yeah. Let's make that You take a picture here now with this. With, with this, this, and then take and a take picture with that. You're going to look different. Off. I remember there was a big scandal. Remember this actress, Gabore Sidibe? Mm -hmm. um, even with Lupita as well. 
they had uh, pictures of her in magazines. There was mm -hmm. one, a big scandal, and they had very obviously lightened her. Because Gabori is quite dark, mm -hmm. you know. Same with Lupita Nyong'o. She's also quite dark. Mm -hmm. And there were two different magazine covers or magazine inserts or whatever where they, their skin had been lightened. There was the same thing where uh, there was a backlash against a lot of ads for a particular cosmetic brand that Beyonce was involved in. Because in those ads, she was notable. Even though she's already fair, she was noticeably <laughs> light. She looked white. She really did look like a Caucasian, you know. So a lot of times, magazines are, as you said, media, are pushing this because you've got a picture of somebody who looks just fine how they are, and then they, with lightning or Photoshop, they just mm. kind of make you look, I you think know. just being yourself, what's um, this girl's name? The girl in, um, in the movie, 12 Years a Sleeve. The yeah, Lupita, yeah. yeah. Lupita. I love that girl. Mm. Like her trousers are very black. As in just the way she is. I love her <laughs> just like that. You know, I think it's about um, the, the complex thing. Be yourself. Mm. You know, love yeah, yourself. A lot of it has to do with self-confidence. Yes. Yeah. Th with, with plastic surgery, everything basically. It's mostly, okay, I'm not comfortable. I'm not confident enough to show this off or to be this way. Mm -hmm. They want to fix it. Which is fine by any whatever, but just know what you're doing. Yeah. Yeah. You and don't be That's pushing it out. Because, I mean, we've had people who say, oh, it, I... I, I, I I've lightened my skin, but it's healthy because I used this and mm -hmm. I didn't use this. Mm. I used oil, I didn't use lotion. I'm yeah. like, what are you saying? Yeah, you're pushing this message. It's out. your skin that is getting lighter. Yeah, yeah that's I the think point. That I think um, they should have placed a law. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you really want this law? Yes. This law. No, no, see, sell your thing, you know, but having you come out in the open to say we should buy to make it. Look like oh, it's yes. When I was young, like, like, um, 10, 14, I know on TV, I saw... There were a lot uh, of those sort of ads. No, I saw um, adverts on, you know, cigarettes. Yeah. But after, okay, yeah, after a, after a while, while, they stopped, they, you know, it. They stopped yeah. it. Now because it's... Because, of, of course, the health. So the same thing standards. should go to, you know, sell your things, but please do not... Perpetuate that that's what yes, it should be. That's what should the be young done. ones would follow. Mm. And, and at some point, we will now lose Africa. <laughs> and it will not look like we're abroad. Well, we Western must, world where we're all fair. We definitely encourage you guys to love yourself for who you are. But we're going to take a quick break and we'll be right back after this. <laughs>